What's going on, folks? All right, out here with the craftsmen. Kicking butt again, man. I want to tell you that one great observation or one great thing that I have found out about this mower, guys, is how much, I mean, it cuts great in mulching mode, but obviously, if you're cutting super tall grass, guys, you shouldn't be mulching grass, all right? It's, it's just gonna be a sloppy mess, and you're probably gonna have to double cut or go over it again. Um, this mower with the side discharge, again, that's what kind of separates this mower from a lot of mowers, guys. Um, you know, I'm not saying this is the only mower that's a three-in-one, but, you know, that the Walt mower, right, um, the Makita that I have, this is really the first lithium-ion mower that I've ever had. I also had the Ryobi 18-volt, um, but this mower has that three-in-one, so side discharge, and guys, it cuts so much better. Because again, it's you just got to use common sense. The grass that's in the deck, when you're mulching, it stays in there and it circulates around in there and it's kind of mulching it up, all right? And it's still trying to cut grass while doing that. When you do the side discharge, it's cutting the grass and it's shooting it right out, all right? So there's less grass in the deck. So you're going to get a little bit better cut and thing cuts great with the side discharge, guys. Um, again, another feature uh, with this mower that, you know, again, you're not going to find a three-in-one mower for $150. And if you didn't see my video yesterday, I actually got the non-self-propelled for $60.99. Okay, so there's no way you're going to get a three-in-one uh, for that price. Um, so, you know... I bought it honestly for the extra battery because now I'm rocking with like 700 amp hours of power if I need it. Uh, but this 7.5, you know, like I said, I do three lawns with this. Um, and I try to make it obviously all in one day so I don't have to bring the push mower back out. But um, it's a great feature, guys. I just decided, you know, I'm not used to having the three in one. All of a sudden I looked at my bucket and I'm like, oh, there's the side discharge shoot let's let's try it and awesome and you're probably saving a lot of battery power too all right so you know like i said it's cutting it and it's getting it out of the deck quick when you're mulching it's just it's the the machine the motor's working extra hard to kind of mulch that up and um obviously if you got short grass you're just taking an inch or two off you can mulch but if you're cutting three four inches the side discharge is uh, definitely a more appropriate, you know, um, application to use. All right, craftsmen, guys. These are still uh, obviously they're still around, and they're really trying to get rid of them now. I've gotten pictures. The lowest that I've seen it, someone got the non-self-propelled for a hundred and nine dollars. All right. Now again, the the unit I got was a floor model and it was right out in front and it said um uh, lowe's super deal craftsman self-propelled mower kit 60.99 and you know i went while i was working so i got there probably around 9 30 yesterday in the morning and um i'm sure if i didn't get there that early i wouldn't have gotten it but they they really kind of got to get you know labor day is the only thing i can think of trying to make room and of course we got the snow blowers coming out and I commented on Instagram I'm a little worried to be honest with you I mean the, the the discounting on this v60 stuff guys I don't know guys I've never seen a platform you know you got to remember the dual 40 volt was around for three or four years before it kind of got discontinued all right now I don't know, maybe Craftsman just going to go with the V20. I'm not sure, but if not, this this is major discounting. I mean, the DeWalt is, you know, going to be discontinued and they're not lowering the prices as as low as this these 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 Craftsman V60 tools. So, I don't know, guys, but you have a 3-year, I mean a 5-year warranty and I I believe a 4-year warranty on the battery, which is really crazy for a battery um but i would not be afraid to get it but just you know if you're kind of into this craftsman stuff maybe you have the mower you really like it
Maybe you got the string trimmer. You really like it. I mean, you might want to finish out your little collection there because I don't know if it's going to be back. But that's not in set in stone, guys. It's just a hunch. And I, I would probably say it is coming back. But I was like 100% it's going to be back because I've never seen a platform. You know, usually they give it a couple years to gain traction and stuff like that. But the discounting has been quite, quite crazy. You know, $499 mower for a, you know 175 and stuff and you know a 399 mower for 60.99 so all right we'll catch you guys